catcher C.J. Webster, uh, fresh off a three-hit game, the what amounts to a walk-off RBI single against New Orleans. Uh, as a, from a team perspective, 16 hits, how good do these feel? Uh, I feel great. Coming off the first two games, uh, those pitchers from UNO, who, by the way, their starting pitchers were pretty good, we were eating out of their hand, and uh, we finally figured out the approach to string together quality at bat after quality at bat. You know, so it was really good for us heading into the weekend, two midweeks. UCA's coming in. We can't look, look too far ahead right now. Uh, great job also. I mean, you, you DH today, but you got to watch Jeff Stovall get a complete game and look like he was, you know, he came out just like you guys did, executed the game plan like he wanted to. No, oh, yeah, it was beautiful. And that's exactly what Jeff needed. It's been, you know, it's been so long since he's had a quality start. But, I mean, when he pitches the last few outings, we haven't given him a lot of run support. So it's really good for Jeff. I'm happy for him. He's in the right direction right now. And also for you, three-hit game, I know you've kind of been fighting at the plate that had to feel good as well. Oh, no doubt. And the thing was is we forget sometimes as ball players this game's hard. So if you get that pitch to hit and you hit it hard, you win. The coach talks about it all the time, so if you stick with that mentality, the hits are going to come. Is that the mentality he talked about that you guys took in the LSU game? Oh, absolutely. I mean, everyone knows what happened last year, and he said he was tired of talking about it. I mean, it's hard not to forget 27 to nothing, but we went down there and we fought. And Coach Maneri said that when we come down there at the end of June, it's going to be a tough regional for them to win.